When I asked Tom Galligan to consider being the interim president of LSU in the fall of 2019, he nor I could ever have imagined the year that lie ahead. We started 2020 with the amazing victory at the National Football Championship, but soon thereafter, we faced a challenge that we never thought we would see. Tom was amazing leading LSU through the global pandemic, the pivot to online education, continuing to support research, our students and our faculty in the most difficult and challenging of times. We went through a summer with a reckoning for social justice. He was there to hear our students' voices every day. Tom then continued to lead us through the year so that we could come back to online and in-person education, bringing our faculty and students and staff back to all our campuses. His leadership has been honest, he's led with humility and with integrity. He has inspired me every day over the last year and a half. He has uh, been, been an amazing leader who, who, who gets it. And by getting it, that means he listens. That means he not only listens, but he takes action. Tom Galligan has served LSU gracefully and graciously over the last 18 months, which are hopefully the most tumultuous our university will ever see. He gave so much to our faculty, to our staff, to our students, and he did it all while wearing that Galligan smile we all love. He leads with patient grace and gentle intelligence that promotes quiet over chaos and agreement among eclectic minds. Tom, I wanted to offer a heartfelt thank you for your service to the students, the faculty and staff at LSU during one of the most challenging and unpredictable times in the university's history. During moments of uncertainty, you offered clarity. During moments of tension, you brought a sense of calm, always brought a sense of calm. And at the most critical moments, you brought good judgment. And in every moment for 18 months, you modeled kindness, integrity, and good humor. Working with you as a, as a colleague and a partner has been really great. And uh, your leadership has been really strong and, and something that uh, I admire. Tom, I know you are so excited to return to teaching and to your writing, and I hope that you will take some time to address your addiction. You can get help. You do not have to answer every email within 10 seconds of receiving it. I've had the pleasure of working with you for the last year on our COVID response, and you have been absolutely incredible throughout the process. Um, I would say as a leader, you exemplify a calm, humble, and thoughtful leader. And I believe that the faculty, students, and staff here at LSU owe you a great deal of gratitude for navigating us through one of the most difficult years of our existence. When the history of LSU is written, President Tom Galligan will be regarded as one of our great leaders. Tom's year and a half at LSU has been marked by great successes and challenges. He's faced them all with good humor, with optimism, with a can-do spirit. I am a better professional because of your example and I will never forget it. And LSU is a better institution because you answered the call when it asked you to lead. He was a wonderful mentor, an exceptional boss, and an even better friend. You've really served the university in ways that are just immeasurable and wanted to make sure that I had a chance to thank you and let you know how much you impacted my life, being able to watch a leader like you uh, lead us through very difficult times. I am so grateful, Tom, to have been able to partner with you over the last year and a half, and I have learned so much about being kind and being calm and carrying on in the midst of chaos. And I owe you an eternal debt of gratitude, as does this entire campus. His leadership, along with, with Provost Taney and a number of others, um, gave us some, some sense of, of, of stability and some sense of proactive measures that, that, that have changed this campus, quite frankly. We appreciate everything you did. There really aren't enough words to express the depth of my gratitude. So I'll just sum it up and say, thanks, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Thanks, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Tom. And I'm looking forward to going to a baseball game soon, buddy.